Thanks, Chad. That's right, the, the sun is shining where I am, which is just about an hour and a half southeast of where you guys are at Millside. This is Goblin Valley, one of the most spectacular places on earth. It's a state park just on the south side of Emory County. This is one of my favorite places to bring my family because there is so much to do and explore. It is absolutely amazing and visually stunning. And we have something special today because we have a group of kids who have never experienced or seen anything even close to this in their lives. And we're gonna to get to experience it with them for the first time. So how about we head out into the goblins? Hundred and seventy million years ago, Goblin Valley was beachfront property. Basically, the ocean came into the middle of the United States, covered the entire thing, but that is how we got the formations that exist today. It was because of the ocean being here and the pressures that we have all of these beautiful goblins that you can go out and explore. And that is one of the things that I love most about coming to Goblin Valley, is that I feel like I'm a kid again. I watch my own children run around and I just want to do it too. I want to jump from rock to rock and just have a blast. And that's exactly what I did today. Goblin Valley is a great park. It's um, got a bunch of hoodoos, um, geological formations. It's similar to Bryce Canyon. Um, it's a great place where People can come out and play in the in the valley amongst the goblins. They can go and climb around and enjoy um, being up close and personal with them. If you want to come down here, there's lots of camping. There's spots for your RV. Uh, there's actually these yurts that you can stay in that have swamp coolers in the summer um, or heaters in the winter. So all year long, you can come down here and enjoy the park. Or Green River is just 40 minutes away, and that they have tons of hotels and restaurants and everything else so it's very easy to get here and stay here and have a great time. And this trip is even better for a couple of reasons. First off, we have some special guests. Some Japanese students have come here and are staying with product reviewer Darren Kinder. He decided that he was going to show them what the West was really about and so our first stop was Goblin Valley. We had a really good time today because we brought five students from Japan over uh, and this is the first time that they've come to Salt Lake five years in a row and, and stayed with us. But this year we actually brought them down to southern Utah's where they can really see the splendor and, the, and what Utah's really known for. It was so much fun to see their faces as they first came over that ridge and saw the Valley of the Goblins. Because by itself, it's really amazing to look yes. at. But then seeing them walk up and look down on it, and this is something that they had never seen before. And I mean not even in photographs. We get to see a lot of photos of Bryce Canyon and Zion and Goblin Valley when we live here in the West. But for them living in Japan, they literally had never seen anything even remotely close to this. And so they were just amazed by it and blown away by the sheer beauty of this area. Uh, it's, it's cool. It's and cool. There's tons of caves and like awesome places. Uh, yes, and beautiful places. And, and they have lots of mm, like a mountain that is different. <laughs> um, yeah. You, yeah. It's like um, so. It's hot, but um, it's fun. It's hot, fun. But yes, fun, yes, huh? but very fun. You know, when you come to Goblin Valley, you, you think, oh, rock formations and whatnot, and it's beautiful, but you don't really think kids are going to clamor to it. And, and every time, whether I bought, brought Jaden down here or other kids, they immediately just love this place. They love racing around. They love climbing around on things. And no different with our Japanese students. They came down here and immediately started climbing all over the rocks and just having a great time playing in the dirt, and it, it is really a magical place for kids. Now our focus today wasn't just so. taking the kids to the Valley of the Goblins. There's actually a place called the Goblin Lair, and this has only been discovered in the last few years. It's actually a hole that you descend, you can rappel into, that's just a giant cave, this enormous chasm. We went on this hike around the outside, and it's so interesting, you go from all those rock formations to out in pretty much a flat desert area. We worked our way back around to the Goblin's Lair, which was really cool. It's this enormous cave that uh, we were able to hike up into and you drop down into it. And you know, it's two or three stories tall and the sunlight's penetrating down into it. And man, it's really worth the hike. It's a, just a little over a mile to come out here. So it's easy to do and, and a lot of fun. There you have it, the Goblin's Lair and Goblin Valley. This is an amazing place you want to bring your family because your kids are going to absolutely love it as you've seen today. Now remember, this time of year it is hot, so you want to bring plenty of water, sunscreen, all the common sense stuff that you know you need to have, bring it. It'll make your trip much easier. Now if you want to get down here, it's really easy to find Darren Kinder. <laughs> get out of here. Try to give him directions. 
So anyway, you just, you, from I-70, you head south on Highway 24, and after about 35 miles, you see the turnoff to Goblin Valley, and you're here. Super easy, and it's an amazing place, one of a kind on Earth. Well, I'm Stephen Heumann for At Your Leisure. Now let's head back to Chad and Alicia out in the dark. Hey guys, if you like that video, you're going to want to watch all of our other AYL videos. You're going to want to like it, you're going to want to share it, and you're going to want to subscribe, right? See all the buttons right here? <laughs> this is what you're going to want to do, click, right? Click, click, click. on them, because we have some really cool videos, all kinds of behind the scenes stuff, bloopers of Alicia crashing and stuff. Why well, are you going to sell me out like that, Steven? <laughs> so you want to click all of these things and subscribe to our channel, because At Your Leisure is awesome, and uh, we'll see you here for more videos.